Hello everybody, my name is Gatis Candis and today I will show you how to attract the aliens. I know my hair is still wet because I just washed it but I don't have time to wait for it to dry because I have a lot of preparation to do. And so the way you attract aliens is you take your drone and then you attach these uh, bright lights. You can see I have 5 meter light strip which I'm gonna now take off uh, my wall and then I'm gonna attach the light strip to this uh, battery uh, the light strip needs 12 volts this is about 12 volts as well it's a very strong battery so i'm gonna touch it at the end of the light strip i'm gonna let the light strip hang down from the drone and then i'm gonna fly up in the air and fly in circles and this is how you attract the aliens and the reason i'm talking so fast is because i want to get it done today because i don't want to wait anymore so without further ado let me get started okay now i'm gonna strip the wire with the wire strippers I'm gonna show in with other camera, it'll be easier to see. Okay, so this is how you strip the wire. You put it in there and then you just squeeze it. Okay, I did it, it actually didn't show on the camera, but it's okay. And so now you just pull it up like so. Ooh, see, pull it up and I'm gonna strip each wire separately. Actually, I can show you still. So the way, the way you strip it, then you strip the wire, you put it in and now you squeeze. And as you can see, like you pulled it apart. And now you strip each one separately. So here we go, like so. Same for the other one. Okay, so then you just twist them together. Uh, red with red. And then black with black. Because otherwise it would not work. It probably would break it. Okay, now I'm gonna use tape to tape it together. Okay, so now I have taped wires together, as you can see. And now actually comes a part that I am a little bit worried about. Uh, I am going to now attach that battery to the LED strip. Uh, the fact that they both are 12 volts does not always guarantee that it will work, you know. Because as I said, this battery is extremely powerful. It can give out like 400 watts. It can literally, it has enough power to push a human. Like if, if you attach that little, well, wait a minute. Where did it go? Where did it go? Oh yeah, yeah. If you if you attach this little battery to electric bike, it will push a human about 50 miles per hour. It's extremely powerful. Anyway, so let let's see what happens. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna plug it in and see whether it works or not. Okay, so I plugged it in. Nothing exploded, which is good. So now I'm gonna try to use the remote. Gonna try to use the remote and see whether it works or not. So here we go, I'm gonna turn it on. Oh, it is working. It's working, I'm very excited because I was not sure whether it would work, but look, it is actually working just with this uh, battery, which is extremely good news because that means all I have to do now is just attach it to the drone and fly it and it will work. I'm so excited, I was not sure whether the battery will work or not, because I was thinking theoretically it should work and it is working. I am extremely, extremely excited. So cannot wait to go to the park. Oh, I was so excited. Okay, so next thing I had to do, I had to take off the LED strip from the wall. I'm gonna put it back on this original case where it came in. And yeah, I'm gonna do that right now. I'm gonna start from this side. Because, yeah, it turns out that you can easily take it off, like even it's sticky, so it comes up like pretty easily. <sighs> and here we go. I have taken up the whole thing from the wall, and I'm just finishing to roll up the rest of it here so you can see how to do it. And there we go, it's all rolled up. I'm just gonna now have a quick check whether it's still working. It better do. Okay, so I'm holding up the whole thing, like it's all self-sufficient. There is battery plugged in, so let's see whether it's working. Here we go, three, two, one. Yes, it's working, very good. You can see very bright, turn it up now. Just realize one more thing I have to do. I need to weigh the whole thing. Hopefully it is not more than 400 grams because the drone can easily carry 400 grams, no problem. But if it's more, it starts struggling. So let me put the whole thing on a scale and see what it says. Okay, so here we go. Gonna put the whole thing on a scale and hope it's less than 400 grams. Okay, it is showing in grams. And here we go. Gonna put it on the scale and lift. No! 
Oh, oh my goodness, it is 500 grams. OMG. Okay, wow, I just uh, found out it is 500 grams. Oh, I think it should be okay, but I think the drone might be struggling. Ooh, you know, the, the main weight is the battery. The battery is really heavy and uh, oh, I'm gonna try it anyways. You know, I got to, to do it. I got, I've gotten this far already. I got to continue, you know, don't give up. Okay, so because I found out the total weight is 500 grams, which is very close to the maximum capacity of the drone, and my plans changed. Instead, I'm gonna use the battery which is in the drone already, uh, because I'm actually able to plug in this piece in there. I just need to tape it up, and then I'm gonna try to use the power from the drone's battery to power the LED lights. I think it should work, so I'm looking forward to finding that out. Yeah I, yeah, I just need to tape, tape the middle wire shut and then make sure that uh, I get the right plus and minus so I don't, I don't uh, kill my battery. Okay guys, now I am way more excited because before, you know, it was too heavy. However, now I'm gonna be using a power source from the drone battery itself, which means uh, the total weight, extra weight is gonna be only maybe like 200 grams, which is totally fine for the drone. And, and I just uh, made sure I put the right wires together, as you can see. And if I turn it on, you can see it's working. So now I cannot wait to get to the park. Actually, first I'm gonna um, uh, eat some potatoes, gonna make potatoes, and then I'm gonna go to the park. And I'm rushing because it's uh, starting to get uh, uh, dark slowly, but I wanna get to the park just before dark. So maybe can fly around in the in dark or dawn, dawn, dusk. I don't know what it's called. Anyway, see you in a bit. Okay, so potatoes are ready and I'm ready to eat because I need energy to meet the aliens. Okay, here you go. You, you get a blow it because it's hot. Okay, I am on my way to the park now. As you can see, the sun is still shining. It's over there. Okay, I'm ready for take up. The sun just set and it is perfect darkness for the aliens to be able to spot my drone with the LED lights attached. So without further ado, here we go. Okay, so everything is ready for the takeoff, and here we go. Okay, here we go. I have unrolled all five meters. I'm gonna. Okay, let's see if I can find it. Okay, so here we go. I'm gonna. Okay, here we go, I'm gonna turn it on. I don't know what it's gonna reach, but here we go, three, two, one. No, it's not reaching. It's not reaching, I need to bring it closer so I can turn on the light. Oh, there we go. Okay, okay, I managed to turn it on. So here we go. The light strip now is flashing very bright. As you can see, I'm gonna fly a little bit further away. There we go, you can see it is extremely bright. And yeah, so you can see it just keeps circling with that five meter LED strip. And that, that's it. This is how you attract the aliens. I'm gonna now bring it back down. Uh, hopefully it doesn't run out of all the battery. There you go, okay. Decided to move over here and then I believe it's gonna come down.
Okay, and uh, that's it. That's how you successfully attract aliens. Uh, I'm sure that you already heard it, that they are here. And so well, one thing I didn't never thought about, you know, when the drone was flying and then when I turned this one on, it was like suddenly extra the work for the battery. However, battery worked completely fine, didn't affect the drone at all. And so yeah, that's it. As you can see, the battery is still there. It's like flashing really bl bright, much brighter than outside is. Turn it off since aliens are here. And that's it. That's how you easily attract aliens. Thank you very much for watching and I will speak to you soon. Subscribe!